Hey everyone, if you want to make your own podcast but you don't know where to begin, Spotify for Podcasters makes it super easy. They've got everything in one place, it's totally free, and you can make money while doing it. Here's how it works. Spotify for Podcasters lets you record and edit podcasts right from your phone or computer, so no matter what your setup is like, you can start doing it today. Then you can distribute your podcast to Spotify and pretty much everywhere else podcasts are heard. Video podcasts are also supported, and you can even conduct polls and Q&As. With Spotify for Podcasters, you can earn money in a variety of ways, including ads and podcast subscriptions. And best of all, the platform is totally free. No catch, totally free. When I wanted to start my own podcast, I did not know where to begin, and I didn't think it was even possible. And Spotify for Podcasters made it happen. They made it easy. They made it quick. And I am doing something that I love. What more can I ask for? So if you're interested in starting your own show, you can do it. And I highly recommend you give this a try. Download the Spotify for Podcasters app or go to www.spotify.com slash podcasters to get started. Hey, everybody. What's up? Welcome back to another episode of Everything Kratom, the podcast about anything and everything. Kratom. Great to have you with us on this Wednesday morning, hoping all is well with you. Today, I wanted to talk briefly about something that I realized this morning. Um, when I take Kratom and it's dark out or dark inside, it doesn't really matter if it's dark. I don't feel the effects as strongly as I do when I'm in a very light environment. It doesn't have to be inside, it doesn't have to be outside. But like, here's an example. If I'm inside a room that's kind of dark and I have taken Kratom, it's like, you know, it's a, it's a, I still feel it, but it's, it just doesn't feel that pronounced, but, but it's not like I think that in the moment, right? Because I take it, it's fine, everything goes as I would expect. The same goes for if I'm in a room that's very light. If I'm in a room that's very light, that has like a really big window, for instance, and has a lot of light shining in. And I sit down at the table there and I'm like, you know, it's like one of those rooms where you almost have to squint (laughs) just to kind of be in there. But it's nice and you just kind of want to soak it in, you know. If I'm in one of those rooms, Kratom feels stronger and it feels a little heavier to me. And I notice that only because of the difference between the two, not because if I'm just in either one of those situations, I'm thinking, wow, this is stronger. Wow, this is weaker. It's the, it's the moments where I'm able to go into one of those environments from the other one when I realize this. So that's kind of what happened this morning. I took Kratom. I was in more of a darker room, not like super pitch black, but I just mean like, you know, one light. It's not like it was well lit. And um, and I was there for a little bit. And then going to my office, my office has a very uh, large window that has a lot of light coming in. And it kind of is one of those situations where you kind of have to squint sometimes in the morning if the if the sun's coming in at the right angle. And, um, and I sat down in there and... And I re- it just felt like a different Kratom experience. And I noticed something, you know, like I noticed that this is something that happens often. It wasn't just a one-off. I often find being in a room that's very light like that, not even just this specific example going from this dark room that I was in to my office room, for instance, any sort of thing like that uh, in the past, it seems to me, based off my memory, which isn't perfect, but we'll go with it for now. <laughs> Let's run with it. It seems to me that in those situations, it's been that I have found Kratom to seem stronger uh, or um, more heavy when I'm in those light rooms. And when I go into dark rooms, I don't find any shift or change. So like, that's the other interesting thing. I don't feel any diminishing effects going into a dark room it's only like going from a dark room to a light room where i feel like an increase in the effects or i feel like it's heavier than it did a minute ago you know how it felt a minute ago but like going from a light room to a dark room it just kind of feels like it almost feels a little bit more 
chill or a little less of the effects, but it, but it not really. It's just more like I can't see anything. <laughs> if it's like pitch black, then it's like, okay, I'm just focused on the fact that I can't see anything right now. But, um, but that aside, that's an interesting part of it that I wasn't even thinking of when I, when I hit record just now. Um, the fact that, that this change is really something I notice when I'm going from dark to light and not as much vice versa. So something to think about. I don't know why that is. Maybe it has something to do with the light, taking in the light. Um, I know that I had one episode in the past where I was like, you know, hypothesizing <laughs> whether, why is it that like when I'm in the sun or in the sunshine, it feels like things affect me more and it can be anything. It could be tea, it could be kratom, it could be alcohol, it could be, you know, whatever. Like it, it just seems to affect me more when it's light out and it's sunny. And my my hypothesis was and is that it's like things are happening like I'm absorbing vitamin D my body's processes are moving so whatever it is that I'm experiencing my body's experiencing it that much more and it's totally not scientific but that's my guess <laughs> and I'll leave it up to to other people to figure out what's going on or to tell me but um but I'd love to know but maybe this is related you know it's not like I'm in direct sunlight though it's 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 like it's just a well lit room could also do this So I don't know, but I thought I would share it with you today. All right, everyone, there's your tidbit. Be back tomorrow and take it easy. Talk to you then. Bye-bye.